Hi tea friends, how's everybody doing today? I'm here to do a little tea review for you guys, but first I just want to explain to you guys how I got my hands into this tea. I'm uh, reviewing Coffee Pereira, and um, me and KJ from Tedious Obsession, um, we did an exchange. I saw a video that she said that she would like to try Espresso Yourself, and right now Espresso Yourself is out of the website, like sold out or something. <laughs> like, hello. So um, I have some, so I told her like, I'll send you a sample. Um, we exchanged some teas and you know, and I told her that I, I would like to try a little bit of the coffee pourer, but she actually sent me a whole package of it. Like seriously, this tea community is amazing. Everybody that I meet, that I met so far is like, seriously, I, I actually want one day to meet all of you guys in person and have a tea with you guys. That would be like a dream. But anyway, besides the point. So I always hear about the coffee puree, like my friend the Tea with Jen loves it and other people love it. So, but I was always scared to try because I don't like puree. At least in my previous experience with puree wasn't good and maybe I like it, it's just, I did not do it right. Anyway, so here you go. Um, I just brew it, I haven't tried yet. Um, and mind you, it looks like coffee. Like literally, this is, this is black, guys. I can't see through it. Um, smells like coffee. It smells like a Starbucks Dunkin' Donut kind of situation. So the ingredients here is pour air, coffee beans, and you can actually see the coffee beans. And then there's the natural um, coffee, almond, and vanilla flavoring. I'm going to open because you guys have to see this. So yes, it's filled with coffee beans. Um, very pleased with how it looks and how it smells. It smells fantastic. It smells like a nice cup of coffee from one of those shops that we all love. So haven't tried yet. It's super hot here, but I'll give it a sip. Wow. This is not what I was expecting. It's delicious. I can taste all the almond, vanilla, and coffee. Definitely coffee. But I was expecting to be like this earthy, fishy, taste because that's what puree tastes in my mind and it doesn't taste like this at all delicious cup of tea I'm gonna add some milk because that's how I like to have my coffee I like to have my coffee with tons of milk in it we'll see what happens when you add the day because that's what KJ told me to do she told me to put some sugar and milk because that's how she said she liked it the best and mm, the color of this tea This is delicious. Like this would be a perfect morning cup. Like when you need it to wake up, it's very high caffeine. Is it strong? It's delicious. I really enjoy this uh, black on its own. You, you know, but the milk is actually doing good too. Wow, this is fantastic. Now, what is the deal with David Tea retiring this tea? Like, if people love it so much, why is David David Tea retiring this tea? Like, like I wanted this in my collection. I'm actually gonna go in the website right now because last night I saw that they had a sale for like four dollars for this bag, and I'm gonna place an order. Um, why are they retiring this? It's besides me, like I really don't understand it. This is a delicious cup. Tastes like coffee. Tastes like those drinks from Starbucks. Those frappuccinos. Is that what they call? I'm really not sure. Wow. 
I wish they would just keep it <laughs> in house. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and uh, this is my take on coffee pourer, and I hope you guys enjoy. And uh, let me know in the comments what you guys are drinking those days. Have a good day.